And when we finally got it done, I was absolutely stunned. I mean, it was far more, sort of, it was just far more powerful than I ever expected. And the, the thing that leapt out at me at that point were the faces of the men. It was actually just their, their, their faces. They suddenly became real people. And so that then told me, because I still didn't know what the, what the film was, but that, was, that told me that, it, that it's, their, it's the story of them. Yeah. It's not the story of the war. It's not the story of the strategy. It's the soldier's story. And then that led to the next step was the only voices we should hear should be the voices of the men. So in a way, I, you know, I went into it just being led by, by you know, as these various discoveries. I mean, the film, was, the film kind of shaped itself, yeah. really, as, as we went along. I was 16 years old and my father allowed me to go. I was just turned 17 at the time. I was 16. And I was 15 years. When they came to us, they were frightened children and had to be made into soldiers. Well, boys, here it comes. We're in the pictures. <laughs> I gave every part of my youth to do a job. Yeah. <laughs>